हेलो गाइस एंड वेलकम टू आवर चैनल सो गाइस इन टुडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट थर्मोडायनेमिक प्रोसेसेस एंड देयर टाइप सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग आवर टाइम लेट गेट स्टार्टेड तो यार वीडियो में आगे बढ़ने से पहले हम ये देखते हैं कि थर्मोडाइनमिक प्रोसेस क्या होता है तो सुनो यार हीट एंड वर्क के थ्रू अपने सराउंडिंग के साथ इंटरेक्ट करके थर्मोडाइनमिक सिस्टम की स्टेट को बदला जा सकता है जब किसी सिस्टम में यह चेंज होता है तो कहा जाता है कि सिस्टम इज अंडर गोइंग अ प्रोसेस मैं फिर बोलता हूं The state of a thermodynamic system can be changed by interacting with its surrounding through work and heat. When this change occur in a system, it is said that the system is undergoing a process. So, यार in very simple language, thermodynamic system की एक state से दूसरे state में change और transformed होने के process को thermodynamic process कहा जाता है This process involves the change of condition or thermodynamic variable such as temperature, pressure and volume. Now let us discuss an example of thermodynamic process. So here I will give you an example of piston and cylinder. So let's do imagine what I will say. Consider a piston and cylinder arrangement in which two weights are placed on the piston. If one of the weight are removed the piston rises and that changes the state of the system let p2 v2 be the initial values of pressure and specific volume before removing the weight and p1 v1 are the corresponding values after the system has attained a new state in this process energy may be transferred from or into the system can be done in or on the system now let us discuss about types of thermodynamic process there are four types of thermodynamic processes they are isothermal process adiabatic process isochoric process and isobaric process now let us discuss these process one by one so first one is isothermal process isothermal is derived from the greek words isos and therm iso means equal therm describe the heat of a substance so isothermal means equal heat this process is also known as constant temperature process isothermal process or constant temperature process is defined as one in which temperature of the system remains constant during the change from initial to final state for an isothermal process dt is equals to 0 that means initial temperature of the system is equals to the final temperature of the system for example the boiling of a water at constant temperature as shown in the above picture the water is boiling but this process occurs at the constant temperature Second one is adiabatic process. The word adiabatic comes from the Greek word adiabatos. Adiabatos means impassible. This system can be considered to be perfectly insulated. So, adiabatic means occurring without loss or gain of heat. This process is also known as no heat transfer process. An adiabatic process is defined as one in which there is no exchange of heat between the system and surrounding during the process. So this process can be considered to be perfectly insulated and energy is transferred only as work. Since there is no heat added or lost in the system, then for adiabatic process dQ is equals to zero. That means initial heat of the system is equals to the final heat of the system. For example, hot water in an ideal thermos flask, because a thermos flask does not allow for the heat transfer to take place through its wall. third one is isochoric process isochoric is derived from the greek words isos and kora iso means equal or constant choric means space or volume so isochoric means same space or volume it is also called constant volume or isovolumetric or isometric process is defined as the one in which the volume of the system remains constant during its change from initial to final state for isochoric process dv is equals to 0 this means initial volume of the system is equals to the final volume of the system for example the boiling of water in a closed vessels in this process the vessels is closed 
means the volume of the water in the vessels remain the same fourth and last one is isobaric process the word isobaric is derived from the greek word isos and baros isos means equal and baros means weight so isobaric means equal pressure or weight this process is also called constant pressure process an isobaric process is defined as one in which the pressure of the system remains constant during its change from the initial to final state since the pressure is constant that is p initial is equals to p final where p is pressure so for an isobaric process dp is equals to 0 for example the boiling of water in an open vessels here the boiling of water takes place at atmospheric pressure only the pressure neither increases nor decreases